Hello guys. Meet again with Movie Adult Recap. In this video we will discuss a movie plot entitled Fancy Message Salon. The film is from Japan and is a romantic drama genre. So, this film tells there is a woman who is struggling to find money and work. Suddenly she meets someone from the massage company. But, the massage in question is a massage that serves guests to have sex. So, before continuing this video, don't forget to subscribe this channel. The film begins when a couple is having dinner. They are named Satomi Dan Yuji. And it turns out that they are having financial problems, especially during a pandemic like now. All food ingredients are expensive. So, they worry about their finances. The next day, Satomi went to the mini market to buy bread. And suddenly, on the way he is intercepted by an unknown man with a mysterious face. The man's name was Yasuda. Then Yasuda offers Satomi a job. But because it looks suspicious, Satomi finally refuses a job offer from Yasuda. However, Yasuda didn't give up on persuading Satomi. He then tried to look at Satomi's hands and said that hands like hers are perfect for working as a masseuse. Yasuda then convinced Satomi that the job was the right job for him. On the other hand, Satomi also requires additional work for living expenses. Because, Satomi was affected by Yasuda's sweet words. Finally, Satomi is willing to accept a job offer from Yasuda. After arriving at work, Yasuda asks Satomi to change his clothes. Meanwhile, Yasuda waited outside the room. But Satomi did not know if there was CCTV hidden in the room. So, Yasuda can see everything that is happening in the room. Yasuda then gave instructions on how to properly massage the customer. Actually the instructions are like massaging in general. Then, that day there was his first customer Satomi. The customer's name is Okada. And Okada it's my first time to come to a massage place like this. No wonder he was a little confused. They then entered the room. And Satomi then started his profession as a masseuse for the first time. Yasuda monitors it remotely through his cell phone. Because, in the room there is CCTV without Satomi and Okada knowing. After Satomi worked all day, Satomi seduces her husband to have sex with her. But apparently her husband refused Satomi's request. Yuji reasoned that he was feeling really tired. Satomi is a woman who is rarely stroked and has sex with her husband. No wonder, if Satomi chose to work as a prostitute. The next day, Okada is already at Satomi's workplace. He admitted that he was very addicted to massage from Satomi. And in accordance with its work rules, Satomi also serves its customers in a polite and friendly. Meanwhile, Yasuda already prepared to monitor Satomi from the CCTV camera. Then Satomi started the massage looking normal. But, all that changed when Satomi saw Okada's penis which was already standing upright. Because feel horny. It turns out that Satomi also feels like having sex with Okada. Because, her body was never touched by her husband. Finally made this Satomi's hand subconsciously move towards Okada's penis to massage it. Meanwhile, Yasuda who was watching Satomi from the CCTV camera was surprised to see what happened. A few hours later, Satomi had finished massaging Okada. Okada then went home and Satomi cleaned his workplace. But, suddenly Yasuda entered Satomi's study. And it turns out that Yasuda has bad intentions towards Satomi. Yasuda told Satomi that all this time he had actually been monitoring Satomi from CCTV. That means Yasuda also knows. If Satomi and Okada have sex. A few days later. After Yasuda feel the pleasure of having sex with Satomi. He also intends to enjoy Satomi's body again. Yasuda also doesn't want to share a sexy Satomi body with Okada. So when the Okada comes. Yasuda told him that Satomi didn't come to work. Hearing that Okada didn't come to work disappointed him. However, a few days later Okada accidentally met Satomi on the street. 
And Okada said that he had come to the massage place for a few days but never met you. It turned out. That Satomi actually felt addicted to having sex with Okada. Then. Satomi invites Okada to go to his house. When you're at Satomi's house, Satomi said. Want a massage here? Okada then answered. Yes I want. And finally after hearing the answer from Okada. Satomi immediately massaged Okada. Satomi massaged from the bottom up. But. The massage in question is of course the massage that makes Okada horny. After that incident. Then Satomi decided to quit his job. And Satomi was also not afraid of threats from Yasuda. And now. It looks like Yasuda is looking for another target. Meanwhile. Satomi has stopped being a masseur. But he is still in a relationship with Okada as his personal masseur. And all that was never known by her husband at all. So. Even though Satomi is still struggling to find additional work. At least. Now he no longer feels lonely. Because. There are Okada ready to serve him to make love at any time. And the movie is over. Thanks for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe. See you.